At the University of Alabama's athletic director is taking the city of Tuscaloosa to task. It's over a fee the city plans to charge for alcohol sales at certain sporting events. Want to get out to Tuscaloosa? WVTM 13's Chip Scarborough standing by to break down the concerns from both sides. So Chip, what are they saying? Yeah, so the issue of concern here is a $3 service fee that will be charged on all tickets at UA athletic events where alcohol is sold. So we're talking about things like basketball games and gymnastics meets here at Coleman Coliseum for starters. Athletic Director Greg Byrne released a statement on Twitter this afternoon that reads in part, quote, It is very unfortunate that the city of Tuscaloosa's plan would unreasonably target Alabama athletics and our fans with a service fee on all tickets where alcohol is sold, even tickets sold to children. There are so many positive impacts our athletics events and the university as a whole have provided that are being discounted, including the extraordinary economic and tax benefits to the city. City Council President Kip Tyner says the $3 fee is not a burden to most people. All I've heard since his tweet came out were from alumni and donors who said, what is $3? I mean, you know, it's nothing to most people. That's what I... I expected that type of response, and so far that's what I've gotten. And these are from Tide Pride people um, that say, and you know, especially knowing that it's earmarked for the pension for our police and firemen. And we did attempt to speak to Athletic Director Greg Byrne on camera this afternoon, but we were told he's unavailable.